Hello guys, this is Miner, and welcome to the first video of 2023. Now this is my rare binder, and this is my common binder, so let's put the rare one on top now, so let's zoom out a bit. So basically this is the official binder, you've seen this in the short, so... On the front it says Alan Kaiser in the logo, so in here it says Alan Kaiser Revolution in Japanese. This is the English text. Now on this side we've got the little Animal Kaiser Lion picture and Alan Kaiser the King of All Animals. No, Alan Kaiser the King of Animals, so on this side we have Al Kaiser Evolution, Animal Kaiser Evolution. I had to repeat that myself because I didn't feel like it was correct. Now on this side, we have the same thing, just with a darker background of Death Scorch. So this is the villain side, and this is the hero side. So basically, let's put this on top. So. Here, let's zoom into that logo. You know what? Here. So. It says, authorised by Alan Kaiser and made in China. Here it says just the company's logo, which is Bondi Namco Entertainment. So, let's get it on this side so I can show you the cards. Okay, you may have seen some of the cards, so I'm going to explain them in full anyway. So, not going to explain to you how I got them. Well, I am sorry. So, here, firstly, we have Master Apollo and Admiral Razor. I'm going to take it out of its little sleeve. It's this beautiful double ultra rare card, two in one. So. As Admiral Eraser and Master Apollo. This is just a scanning, so this is the reverse side. I got this by trading my only type of gold card, Owl oh, card, so I only had one of that card, so it was like the the card I had was a Mecha Gorilla DX and Gen Crusher, so. That was what I traded for this. Alan Kaiser clips had two of these and I only had one, so that kind of made it fair. So I'm going to put this beautiful card right in my binder. So let's put it in. Let's put it back in. There we go. So next to it we have Brutus. And I'm also going to get out Hercules Beal because it also involves that. I only really wanted to get the Hercules Beal for £10 because I thought it was a good idea. But it also came with a Brutus, so that's the best mistake of my life, really. So, yeah. They also have quite old versions, which I can't get anymore without buying. So, this one is regular, regular Evo 8, and this one is... Evo 7, so those are the reverses. Pretty cool, I'd say, for a £10. So, yeah. £10 for two of these, so, yeah. I'm going to put these back in now, so... I'll put these back in. I'll explain the second page in more detail, so... That'll be good. There we go, so... Now, King Cobra, I got with the binder. Let's just focus on that a bit. So, King Cobra, again, I got with the binder. Let's get this out. This is version 4. Not even joking when I say that. Let's focus on it. So, there, version 4. This side is a beautiful gold card. Lovely. 
I'm going to put this back in because it's a bit wrinkled since I got it because of the wrinkly uh, sleeve and the tight binder. If you're wondering why well, these pearly things here because it's been badly super glued before so that's why it has but at least it's functional enough for me so here we have Yoku Zuna and Reed, my first independent goals animal card. A double, by the way, so pretty good, I'd say. Now, I need to get this here, so I'll have to focus on this double page. Hercules Beetle, you already know. Great white shark. Uh, I was given this by my friend who's sadly not playing out with Kaiser anymore. Uh, Alien Vault and Kaiser Fighters, um, I actually got those independently, well, Alien Vault I got twice, so I traded, and got this very nice card, so, um, Alligator Snapping Turtle was my first r rare card that I got, so I have, I actually have two of them, by the way. Let's focus. Is it both the same version? They're both Evo 8DX versions. So I'm going to put them back in the binder now. Uh, Mighty Fighter, I was given that by Alan Kaiser Clips, so that's quite a good one. So that was when like we didn't know of gold animal cards, so that stayed with me for a pretty long time that so let's focus on to this area now. So here we have Vicious Battle and Approaching Sun. On this page we have Master and Pupil A Lone Warrior Friends Forever Alien Egg O, Alien Egg A, on this side of the page now. Baron, Alien Egg M, it kind of looks all rainbowy. Ice Meteor, my first bronze. Shining Supernova, Decisive Battle. My first battle cards, Tanumaru and Giant Panda. Uh, Komodo Dragon and Night. Now Crocodile, Master Jumbo and Ace, Absolute Warrior and Matter Matter. Uh, with Matter Matter I actually have two of them, so... On this final bit of the page, I'm going to go straight to the Great White Shark. Uh, supposedly version 1 card, so... If it... I, I'm going to tell you how to check if your card is a version 1, so... It, it if it says nothing by the a Japanese symbol, that means you've got version one. It's a promotion card, probably printed since it's around the time version one was released, so I'm gonna put that back in. Uh the last three cards I have are Mega Shark, Mega Gorilla and dark power. Now, in further detail, my common binder is just full of junk cards. Here we have some of the older regular cards. Uh, I think the only good things I've seen are hip the hippo characters. So I've got regular hippo Harry there. So not sure where hippo Barry is. So I think he's at the back. I'm not sure. I may not have Hippo Barry, so that's just a lot of version 4s and 6s. I may have some version 5s that I just don't care about, so that's it for the video now. Like and subscribe. You may also see that I'm using a different f video editing software and my thumbnail is looking a little different than usual, so like and subscribe, hit the notification bell, and I will see you all in series six. So, 
I'll be featured then. So see you and goodbye there for then.